Hello, and welcome to our lesson on dividing by powers of 10 using a place value table. So we begin with question A. We have 3,500 divided by 100. And because we're dividing, we're moving every number to the right two times because there are two zeros in 100. Zero units moves to the hundredths. The zero tenths moves to the tenths. The five hundredths moves to the units. And the three thousandths moves to the tenths. So 3,500 divided by 100 is 35. For question B, 120, and we're dividing, so we're moving to the right, by in this time, three places. So with zero units, move in to the thousandths column. The two tenths moves to the hundredths, and the 100 moves to the tenths. So we have 0.12. Do you want to try and calculate question C, D and E by pausing the video? And you can resume it when you're ready. Okay, for question C, we have 0 0.47. And we're moving it two places to the right because of the two zeros. So we have a 7, 4. Here we have the 0. And here is a placeholder in the tenth column. So we have 0 0.0047. For question D, 515.4 divided by 1000. So we move three places to the right. So the 500 going to the tenths. Then we have a 1, a 5, and a 4. So 0 0.5154. And question E, not 0.69 divided by 10. So we move every number to the right by one place. So we have a 9, the 6, and the 0, which is not 0 0.069. Okay, let's try one more question. So do you want to try and complete this by the diagram below by pausing the video and you can resume it when you're ready. Okay, we're going to begin by working out this value. We have 5,218.6. And we're dividing it by 10, so every number moves to, moves to the right by one place. So we have 521.86. For this value, we move every number to the right by two places, because of the two zeros in 100. So we have 52.186. And now for this question, we begin with 5,218.6. We end with 5.2186. And because we're moving to the right, we know it's a division. And we're moving to the right by three places because this 5,000 lines up with this five units. And because it's three units to the right, it is divided by 1,000. And finally, for this value here, we begin with 5,218.6. We end up with 0 0.52186. You can see we're moving to the right, so it's a division. And we're moving two, three, four places. So it's the division of 10,000 because there are four zeros in 10,000. Okay, thank you very much for watching and I hope you found that useful. Thanks again and take care.